Today, Tuesday, marks the official opening of WISIS 2015. And for the first time, it's being held in the premises of the World Intellectual Property Organization. It makes for a dramatic backdrop to the opening ceremony. Joining the opening proceedings with a video message was UN Secretary General Ban Ki-moon. People today are better connected than ever before. I count on this forum to help bridge the digital divide so that people everywhere can reap the benefits of connectivity. Another highlight of the day, the awarding of the project prizes. Sustainable Development Goals. It was always part of the original vision of WISIS that the impact of strategies adopted be open and measurable. Across the different areas of to help manage what is, after all, an extremely complex challenge, WISIS developed a series of action lines, that is, ways to divide up the work to be done to make it more manageable. For the category one, action line C1. The project prizes are open to any organization or group involved in the projects that help bring those goals closer. I'm very happy and very proud from Kuwait and uh, this is gift I I give it for my all Kuwait. Delighted. This is sort of on top of the world. This is great. We have been working consistently with youth organization, with youth young people. And actually, this is the price that they are also paying. This is also their price because actually they voted for us. They asked their friends, their colleagues, their organization to vote for us. So we are very proud of that. Competencies as well. Another feature of today's events at WISIS 2015 was the high level dialogue on post 2015 sustainable development goals. It's because of the strategic choice of the country. Just what role will information and communication technology play in that vital global strategy? can help implement the sustainable development goals. For Hu Lin Zhao, Secretary General of the ITU, it's clear the development goals must pay more heed to ICTs. But if you look at the actual situation, you will find that we're still, unfortunately, a little bit far away from our goals to have everybody connected and particularly for those who are not connected yet. So we have to, to organize this uh, platform, uh, this event, uh, to mobilize uh, all the family members come together to review the progress, to see the challenges in front of us, and then to work hard to reach our goals. And so, after the opening ceremony, after a high-level dialogue on the WESIS action lines and how they fit with the Sustainability Development Goals, and of course the prize giving ceremony, day one, the first official day, draws to a close. Join us tomorrow when we'll be looking at innovation and empowerment. <laughs>